All right, guys, welcome back. We're going to start with the second clan. This is PMC. They're just getting everybody in. And then we will begin the second round. So remember, uh, OSN was the first clan to do this challenge. It's... Uh, try that one again. They're playing the Nucleus map, co-op, realistic. All four players have to get to the end. And there's no glitching or using the game as unintended allowed. So OSM went first. They had a time of three minutes and two seconds, which is considering that they are the best competitive clan at the moment in the multiplayer scene is definitely a standard to aim for. PMC are one of the up and coming clans. It's going to be very interesting to see just how well they do this. They spent the last, let's see what time is it now? They spent about the last hour practicing and they've gone through and tested quite a few things. So they may do slow and methodical, they may do fast, but they have to have that balance between being able to do this quickly and beat OSM, whilst at the same time, oh yeah, back again, Joe Stock. I just turned it off a little bit. Uh, so they got to have that balance between being able to say, get through quickly, uh, because you need to get through to beat three minutes, two seconds. Uh, at the same time though, if you lose members, if they die to CTRs and bots, then that means you are going to end up spending time reviving them because you have to have all players left. So Joe, if you watched this before, this is a CTR's eye view of what happens of what you can see. So that's one of the CTRs I think are waiting in that initial area. It looks like it. Let's go find the PMC guys. We there they are. Let me just check. I want to make sure that I've got that. Yeah, I just want to pause Get that up. That's good. Here we go, so it's uh, it's four man corp, obviously. They're just bringing the fourth guy in now. So we've got PMC Jetzel. We have got Jumping Monkey, and we have got PMC Super Game, the clan leader. Like pretty much all the clans, PMC are, of course, recruiting for their clan. If you want to join them, visit firegaming.com. Uh, you'll see it's on the overlay, but it's phyregaming.com. And if you want to join these guys, apply for them. OSM, who were the first clan, are also on there as well, but I'm not sure. Actually, Joe, if you can let me know, are you guys uh, recruiting at the moment, or are you on a fixed roster? Those are the sea charts that are waiting for them. This is what you see when you come out of the map. It's like flying through space. These are the particle effects that we have through parts of the map. And as any FPS player does when they're waiting for something, they're going to start firing. There we go. And playing with laser. That's quite a nice flare effect. All right, so uh, you guys keep it down at five. You should be able to have more than five people on the team and on the website, though. If that's not the case, just give me a yeah and I'll fix that. So we've moved websites recently to... Uh, the last one wasn't very good at managing teams or allowing clan leaders to manage their own teams. So we changed it significantly now so that clan leaders can manage their own teams. We've still got some work to do on the site itself. But it's starting to come along, getting some contents on there, getting some things going on. Is there an ETA? If you guys can also, the guys in the stream, just let me know. Does my uh, voice sound okay? I'm using a different mic this time, I'm not using the headset mic, I'm using uh, the Blue Yeti. 
which is a mic I've had for a long time but hardly ever used for some reason. That's the reason why. The Blue Yeti, I mean... The Blue Yeti is a fantastic microphone. If you use it up close and personal, it grabs everything that you have. I will never do that again. But it is a fantastic microphone, and hopefully Finn listens to this because it doesn't have that sound in the background. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So the microphone is very close to the keyboard. And uh, it does tend to pick up all the sounds and things, which is not good. What I'm going to do is get one of the boom arms, so the microphone will be kind of down here or something like that, or I don't know, down here. Okay, there we go. Right. Let's rock and roll. Press the right button, press the right button, press the right button. Two, one, go! Right, where are they? There they are! Go, 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 go! Super Gamer, Jetzel, Carbon Seed, and Jumping Monkey. Can these guys beat three minutes, two seconds by OSM? Well, they need to be careful, Super Gamers getting hammered from behind. They're a little slower than I would have liked. Let's see if we can find a CTR that's somewhere close to them. That one might be. No. There's a. Ooh, that's a dead one. That's a live one. So CTR is eye view. Let's see if this is one of the ones that's going to go in and attack. And if you're anything like me right now, you are getting vertigo. Right, let's just go through and find that. Jetzel's engaging. Take what? And it's curious. They're using suppressors. That's a little unusual. So they are now one minute and seven seconds in. They're less than a quarter of the way through, roughly. They need to speed up a little bit. They're just waiting for that. There they go, so they can go through now. One minute, 25 seconds. Jetzel's taking that one out. Yeah, they need to be running rather than walking. You can, yeah, that's exactly what you can do. He's waiting for his teammates, which is probably a smart move because if he gets taken out, and they can't revive him, then that's his team out of this challenge. Keep pressing forward, keep working together. Ah, they're not moving forward, it's two minutes now. Two minutes, <laughs> two minutes, five seconds. Come on guys, you need to boogie woogie. Right, they're going for the same event that OSM went for. So they've definitely done their homework. A little bit of lag, that's probably due to me uh, streaming and also spectating at the same time. Don't have the best internet connection, unfortunately. So they got through, they got the key card. Two minutes, 30. Holy shit. I see where Super Gamer is, he's a little bit behind. So Jumping Monkey's engaging. Uh, top fragger at the moment does seem to be Corbin Seed. There he is. He's right at the back. Remember, this is not about points for a killing bot. This is about getting to the end. It's 253, 4, 5. They're not going to make it. So OSM are going to be the number one clan. They've got to play down as well. It's Super Gamer. Three minutes, three seconds. Okay, so they've not managed to do it. That's a shame. But let's watch the rest of this run through. Oh, you got through Avent, Novacon. I'm not quite sure which vent you got through. Holy shit. That's a lot of dead bots.
That reminds me of that match a few weeks ago in CSGO where they had <laughs> four ops at the end of the first half on T on Dust 2. And there was a meme about that. Whatever the player's name was that went up. And this player, at this point, this player knew he'd fucked up. <laughs> right, so they got into the elevator. So they're at 357 now. Let's see where they are. Alright, one, two, three, four. Alright, they're four minutes ten, so they're significantly over at this point. Another con, you're confusing me. If you continue to confuse me, I will use this voice. Right, so they're almost at the end. Hey, oh, that's not the right place to be. Where do they go? There they are. Are they going in the No! Oh, Corbin C's gone down. This is going from bad to worse for PMC. 453 now. That's two of them down. Three of them down. What off? That's it, they're not going to be able to complete. But a valiant effort, no less. Maybe next time we should do this with only two people. And he's down as well, so it was 5.18 but not a finish. So let's see if they want to have one more go. It doesn't count. It counts as a DNF. But, well, let's see. It's for their honour. So, right. So, yeah, let me actually just reset this one. So that was 519, nine, five but does not count. Let me just... Actually, that's about the worst possible time to do that. Right, off they go. Let me just quickly find this. Right, let's see how they do it this time. They are dying. This isn't good. So there's one res going on here, which is Super Gamer on Jetzel. And the other one is Corbin Seed on. Did he get him up? He didn't get him up! Ah! They've noticed that they're having issues with the revive. So I think we might need to check that and just have a quick chat with them, just see if there's any kind of bugs there. Super Gamer is taking that player out. We've got Corbin Seed there. Even more CTRs coming in. Even more CTRs coming in. Oh, oh, sounds like Darth Vader. Where's the other player go? Nope, that's a dead CTR. Carbon Seed, Super Gamer, and there's Jetson. There's Jetson, right. So the 1 minute's 46, and it wouldn't count anyway, even if they had all four players up. But having just three players just make this a little more difficult for them. Yeah, uh, PMC mentioned this earlier, Joe Stock, that there seems to be an issue with the revive. I'll make sure that's passed on uh, on Monday. Ah, 
ready to get the AR out. Taking a lot of damage. That is a lot of dead CTRs though. How many live CTRs are around? They've killed quite a few, they've done a good job. Right, so at 2 minutes 36 now with only a three man crew. They do need to move faster. Especially if they want to beat their own time of 519. Oh, Jetzels! It's the zombie horde! He does it! He does it! <laughs> he managed to survive. Nice one. That I did not expect. And there you have an argument for a horde mold. Yes, Jostock, uh, since you're on the, on the chat on the channel. I was thinking what we could do, perhaps, is to have maybe a single Hell Week zone with, say, Clan versus Clan in there. Everything is the same. We don't have a grace period, or I have a grace period the same minute. <laughs> uh, or a couple of minutes in there, but the rest of it, we just have Clan versus Clan in a Hell Week. Have a think, let me know what you... Because it's just, it's just a merely a matter of setting up a server. It's, there's no coding or anything involved. That thing would be fun. I have CTRs in there as well, because we, well, we have to have CTRs, are in there now anyway. I might just do that. I, I like the idea of doing that, actually. And the really cool thing about what we're doing here is that we have the full support of ZPS, so any kind of crazy stuff like that we can do. And use their servers, obviously. Oh, Jetzels! Being overrun, that leaves just Super Gamer and Carbon Seed. And 5 million CTRs I have to cycle through. If anybody sees a ZPS game, Kim, give me a yell, please. So Super Game is still up. He's the only one up. He's going for the res. Please work, please work, please work, please work, please work. He's at 432 now. He got the res. Good, he's going for the next one. In realistic, the amount of time to res increases. So that actually might be a question. If the animation is not matched up to the amount of time it takes to actually revive, that could be what's causing this issue. And that is a bug we've had before. Where the animation circle has been at a different speed to the actual revive itself. Right guys, they are... 10 seconds. And they're going to hit the time they did originally, so they're not going to match the original time, but they do only have four, uh, three people. And they've had a lot more reviving to do. Yeah, so just like I was thinking with the new teams, because you can have two clans teamed up together. That would be interesting. I wonder if supply drops would work. Yeah, they should do. You might still get the announcements about supply drops in, say, Jungle, uh, or whatever. But... It, yeah, the fundamentals should still work. Yeah. I might just play with that. So the three remaining guys are pressing forward. I am pressing buttons to go forward. There they are. Jetzel's down. That's a lot of CTRs. You can also see CTRs moving around as well, which is pretty cool. There's someone that could have come in and threw a flank. One, two, three. Six, eighteen. Uh, a little bit slower. But, not bad. Yeah, it just depends, Joe, because it does... The animation could be... Uh, the amount of time to revive could be significantly slower than the animation. So that is a bug we've had before. Right, let me just go and see if the next group are ready. Channel switch. Like, um... Guys? My, uh... What's uh, up? Are you guys ready? Ah, we wish. Uh, <laughs> as will ever be, I guess. Okay. Okay, That's so... Good to go. I'll ask PMC to leave the server, and then if you wait, guys want to... Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. Uh, Mom's calling me. Uh, I'll be back in, like, 30 seconds. Okay, now we'll be ready. All right. All right. Honestly, his mum was hoovering his room earlier, now she's calling him. 
What did PMC finish at? Uh, their best time was 5.19, but it didn't have all players. So the current uh, time is 3 uh, minutes, 2 seconds. Alright. Right, let's join uh it's basically five when I get off uh when I get off that room with a key card, just try to cover me because there'll be about two or three uh CDRs. Yeah, I thought they were all gone. Alright guys, um, if you can please join the server, I'm gonna go back to my uh channel. User joined your channel. Oh Blade has returned. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely What's going there. Channel <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, so... Yeah, in case none of you have ever done this before, if you're a dev or if you're an admin, you have this. Uh, and you also, you don't, do you have this? You don't have it on co-op, but you do have it on multiplayer where you can change the map and you can change the mode as well. So, if you do find that someone's been a, excuse my French, dick, and you are an admin, you can kick them if you want to. I need to actually leave. I love our community. Right. Oh, someone send me messages. Uh... I think I'm sending myself messages actually looking at that. Right. Right. This is an amalgamation, I think, of two clans. Which is why they're calling themselves A, B, C, D, F, G, X, Y, whatever. So, let's see what these guys are capable of. Oh, Crumbs are going to go now. Right. Last one. I think this is going to be the last one of the day. Uh, it's taken a little longer than I expected, but that's okay because it's just this is just fun, and it's something that we're doing as a warm up for the go for the season, uh, the competitive season start in a couple of weeks. Oh, crap! Right, let's see what we can do. Blade, the gobbiest person in I am, I think. Good, they're moving fast. That's what they need to do. Let's go on a first person with Blade. Why are they hanging around? Okay, well, there's no need for that, but they're they're a bit slow. They are definitely a bit slow. Blades dying to go. Ah, bots eye view! Yay! Bots dead eye view. Uh there we go. Right, let's watch Fashtar. So Fashtar is definitely top fragging at the minute. They are at a 1 minute and 7 seconds so far. It feels, actually it feels very slow actually. Joe Stuck, if you're watching this, it feels definitely slower than you guys. Uh, looks like he may have the proxy bug. Yes, he has. So he's reloading, which is good. God damn, that's some firefights. Look at the stream of CTRs. Holy shit. They lost a player. They're now at 1 minute and 45 seconds. Running through. They're speeding up a little bit. Probably not enough though. They need to get all the players in here. Jesus, excuse my French again. And literally hightail it straight for there. Got in. Yep, there we go. Kill that bot. Bot becomes invisible. That will be a sector bug. Which is, uh, we use sectors in, in order to be able to, um, if there's not a player within the sector or can see it, then we will stop things like AI or physics within that area. It's to increase FPS. 
Uh, but sometimes it can overlap or happen in strange places. So they're at 240 so far. So there's a chance that bot might reappear. No, it's not. Okay. 250. They've got 10 seconds left. 7, 8, 9, 3 minutes. 1. Oh, they just missed it. Unlucky, guys. 3 minutes, 6 seconds. Oh! <laughs> right, let's see if they can do it. So OSM have won this, unless another clan turns up. And I didn't see any on TeamSpeak. So let me just... Uh it was what, 3 or 6 wasn't it? Right, let's get back in, let's reset that. One, go. Right, so let's see if they can do it this time. I don't think he's alive. I hope it's not live anyway. Ah, uh, Monad's done something. Right, so they got one, two, three. Right. I think that they're going to start to go live. I apologize for whacking the keyboard a little bit. I'm going to get a, a boom microphone so you don't get that kind of noise in the future. Right, so. Let's see. They have got to beat three minutes, two seconds. To be able to beat OSM. This run doesn't count. They've already had the run. This is for honor and satisfaction and nothing else because OSM already have this by four seconds. Ah, oh, they're going through the vents, good. Uh, we're following Blaze, so he's going to drop into this room, uh, kill the two or three CTRs that are in there and then he should take the key and come out. It's a much faster way of doing this. Did he get the key? He didn't get the key. Oh, it's going to cost at least four seconds. Right, so they got a couple of people at the front. Good, good. This one feels like it's going to be a good run. Why is he hunting that bot? He keeps going after that bot. Oh, that's not good. Blade's down, five stars down. Sam Fisher is uh, having issues with the assault rifle. Alright, so they just need to res Blade, wherever he is. It looks like they've just abandoned him. Blade, you're gone! Oh, they're getting a hit by from behind. These are uh, realistic CTRs. It's a realistic map that they're on. So it only takes a few hits to... Jesus. They're only a few hits to be taken down. Sometimes the CTRs will miss, but when they don't miss and they hit you, it hurts.
what we should do, I might see if I can arrange this, is see if we can get uh, four ZPS people together and see what times ZPS people can do. See if they can beat the best clan. Oh, oh, five star, you're my only hope. They're all dead, they didn't have you. All the ignominy. <laughs> Right, let's see if they want to go again, just for shits and giggles. <laughs> hey, wake up. Nope, oh, someone sent me messages. No, they're not live. Right, so if this is not safe for work, channel switch. It's not my fault. Yes, gentlemen. Yeah. Hello. Basically, yeah, it's just a question about this thing. Yeah. Uh, I got the key card. Yeah, basically, uh, you know, uh, as I was telling you earlier, you know, we just formed this team. Uh, our <laughs> our two other members came on. Is are we? If we uh, do it again with them, does it count as a different run? Uh, no, because I think it's what, it should. Yeah, I know what you think, but one <laughs> one player gets one run. So if they formed a new team with, on their own with four players who've not run before, then yeah, but otherwise not. Okay, but we then we can just do it non legitimately then. Yeah, they can certainly do the run with you if you want, just simply for uh, you know pride. And I died. Well, I think that if they win, you know, they should. They they know they're the real winner at heart. <laughs> Four seconds. That, I, <laughs> how we that have was to, as good as it gets. Yeah, seriously, we, we have to evaluate that? that stream frame by frame. <laughs> <laughs> how, mu how much did they pay you, Firefly? How much? We'll way, double it. Way more than you've got. <laughs> <laughs> right. So are you yeah. are you guys more, coming more than, in or? Yeah, uh, yeah. We're, we're going to get the other people here. Yeah, more than what you're worth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> so we're, we're going to do it. Um, well, well, thanks Five Star and Monad for uh, coming to yeah, us in our hour of it was fun, and the first round yeah. was amazing. We are the real winners in my heart. Yeah, we are the real <laughs> ones. <laughs> okay. Pretty much. So Firefly, we're gonna do it, uh, we're in Team 1. So, uh, yeah, we're gonna join the server. User okay, I'll go back to my channel. channel. Channel switched. And there we have the ever effervescent Blade. So, looks like we got a few more of the members up, and we are going to have some more fun. It'll be a fourth round, but it won't count. That's okay. Have all of them left? Let me just check. They've all left. So I will come back in. Just make, I'm doing this just to make sure uh, because the first person to join a server sets uh, the server's difficulty level and you can see on my screen here it's realistic. Oh hello chaps. So if I join first to make sure it's unrealistic because I can't see as a spectator should I actually <laughs> I'm gonna get some shit for that afterwards. Actually, oh, they joined as either private or whatever. I'm gonna have to restart the server. Let me just check. Oops, sure. Yeah, okay. Give me a sec. I need to just quickly restart the server because someone's joined it. Channel switched. 
Uh, guys, one of you joined it either as friends or private. If yeah, you I, please... I know. Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna, bad. I'm gonna restart the server now. Okay. God. Channel switched. So just give me a sec. Where is I three Ds? There we go. Bum, 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 bum. So Marines, nucleus, which nucleus, and U S East. I think it's located. If I remember correctly, make sure it's the server. It's definitely the server. Stop the server. So uh, all of our servers, uh, all of our servers actually, are hosted by I3D, and they have a centralized control panel that we manage them through. So it can, it's it's as good as it can be, given the uh, the basicness of our server architecture or our server uh, build at the moment. So it's fine. In the future, though, we definitely want to add some more things to the server build so it communicates with the control with I3D's control panel, and then you can get a much better idea of anything that's going good or bad. So if I, oh, they, they just changed the control panel, and okay. Yeah, I no right. Chaps, let me. Ah, oh. bugger. Right, they changed it now, so we've got some different ways of doing things, but hopefully, this will bring the server back. Or if it doesn't bring the server back, then I'll screw it up somewhere. Yeah, it's the right server. What I want to do is to check the status of whether it's listing as up or not on the control panel, but they change things, which means I cannot do that. Right, that doesn't actually help. And it's not back up yet. There we go. Good. Right. Make sure it's unrealistic. Yep. Make sure somebody else joins, and they will, of course, kill me when they come in because I did that to them. Now, in case you guys don't know, if you press U, actually, if you press F1, you can invite your friends in. Like that. As you can see, I've got lots and lots of friends because I'm very popular. Uh, if you press F1 again or escape, it disappears. If you press U on the bottom left, you'll see your ping. There we go. Excellent. And some other information about the, the server that you're on. Uh, the ping stuff only works in Core Multiplayer. does not work in Hell Week. And there's an architectural reason for that. Because the way that... I, right, so getting a bit technical now. The way that a Hell Week works is you connect to a, the server that you see on the server browser. Christ, they're all 2100s. And then that, that's what's one server. And then that will immediately pass you on to one of the nine zones. And each of those nine zones runs on a separate server. So there's 10 servers in total in a Hell Week cluster, the, the cluster master and the other nine servers. Those nine servers are not visible in the server browser, we ha we actually don't even connect them to the master server system. It's only that cluster master that's visible. And when you ping, you have to ping from the individual server. So that's the reason why we don't do it out of Hell Week. Uh, uh, we can add that in the future, it's not a big deal to do it, it's only 10 minutes of work. I just didn't get around to it uh, when I was adding the stuff on the bottom left. Right, let's see how these guys go. Looks like we're ready to rock and roll for the last one. This should be the last uh, run. Remember, it's three minutes and two seconds that they need to beat. Uh, this won't count because some of these players have already been on, but that doesn't matter. This is for 
pride, for honour and all that good stuff. Try and get the dude at the front. Uh, Professor! Right. Are they using the vent? Doesn't look like they're using the vent. Switch the vent. The blade might be going through the vent. Blade has gone through the vent with a CTR behind him looking forlornly at his backside. Right, now this last time he. Oh, he's got it first time. Good. Takes out the CTR. Sees the next CTR. Takes that out. Good. They need to be running a bit more though. They're now at 47 seconds in. Seriously, he's got a hard on for that CTR. And we're just about to hit one minute now. So, pro tip in inverted commas flashlights and lasers will attract CTRs. You can get past them a lot more stealthily if you uh, don't use them. Also, look at that. Your suppressor. Uh, CTR is attracted to sound. And a suppressor will lessen that attraction also. So you can play stealthily if you want to. And we're looking at adding some Steam achievements and things which encourage stealth play. This is a nice run. 1 minute and 40 seconds. This could be OSM. They got one player down, Picasso. Alright, it wouldn't count. I mean, it doesn't count anyway, but it wouldn't count because you've got to have all four players at the end. Ah, Finn's taking part. Awesome. Right, so 2 minutes 12 seconds now. Ah, uh, blade's gone down. Let's watch Finn. The newcomers may not know about the four men to the end rule. That's fine. <laughs> so there we go. I'm not sure if that failed. Oh, Sam was the last player. Okay, it doesn't count. <laughs> Anyway. Alright, one more. Just because this is so much fun. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, guys in the, the chat, can you please let me know just how the stream is? I know I'm sometimes a bit paranoid about this stuff. Right, let's see where we are. Have they started? No, wasn't ready. Sorry about that. My bad. Three, two, one, and go! Right. We're off. Where are they? There they are. If the bots can be kept off his bike, that's nice work, Blade. Let's watch Finn. Oh, Finn's gone down. They need to res him quickly. Bit like because he's resing Finn. Has he got him up? Has he got him up? There's a prob There's definitely a problem with the revive. No, he's not getting him up, I don't think. Nuts. There you go. Okay. So that's definitely a confirmed bug. We'll get that fixed. Right, so Blade is there. Picasso is there. Alright, looks like Finn's back up. There he is. Awesome. <laughs> Excuse my French. Oh, God. 
<laughs> it's like watching the, the film Gravity. We... Both of them have gone down. We... Can you shoot him? We do have this on our list of things to fix. It's introduced with Unity 5. Uh, and it's just something we know roughly where in the code it's being caused, but we don't know why. So we've got, if you look at our Trello, uh, you'll see that there's a card in there to be able to get this fixed. Because it's infuriating for you. Obviously, it's infuriating for them. And it's extremely infuriating for us. So let's do that. But early access. So, oh, that was a bot then. Sometimes these things happen. Four, three, two, one, go! I just wish it didn't happen on stream. Right, let's watch. Uh, let's watch Finn. Finn is actually the best Hell Week player there is, and uh, he won a competition uh, a couple of months ago, a Hell Week competition. So there will be a shrine to TMS Finn, which will be going uh, into Hell Week. And that's one of Kim's tasks for update 23. Blades just dropped down in there. Right, so that means that... Who's that? That's Sam Fisher. Let's find Percussor. Right, so he's running back from switching on the control panel, going the quick way. He needs to deal with that bot before it deals with him. Good, he's got it. Let's move forward. Blaze in that loving embrace there. Let's see where we're at now. Get ready for the hordes. You can't shoot through glass. Not yet, anyway. Nice shooting. Uh, why are we always watching play? Let's go watch Sam Fisher. Sam Fisher's a fairly new name to me. This is looking good. They're at 1 minute 36 now. All four players alive. You want to get all four in there. Good, they've managed it. They're going to run straight through as quickly as possible. Get to the elevator. Completely missed that shot. Right. So they're at two minutes, one second. So they've got just under a minute to do the last section, which shouldn't take more than about 30 seconds. But let's see. This is turning out to be a really good run by these guys. They're probably regretting not running with this crew at the beginning. They're now at 2 minutes 20 seconds. Big fight developing here. Sam Fisher's gone down. Blaze moved to the final point. So there's Finn, Sam Fisher, and Picasso. Let's see where we go at. One, two. Two minutes. 54 seconds. 0.98. That, if that had been uh, a proper run, they would have won. <laughs> All right, so uh, let me just double check to make sure there's nobody else on TS that wants to have a go. Let's see, yeah, that's the final team. So OSM wins. Joe, if you guys uh, are still on the stream, congratulations. Really, really, really well done. 
Uh, you were the first guys to go. You've also done your practice. You are still the premier clan in Interstellar Marines. So well done. Uh, definitely, let's see what other scores did we have. PMC didn't finish. The mixed clan, let's call them. Got three minutes, six seconds. Only four seconds behind OSM, so that's not far off. And then this final one was 2.54. Uh, but did not count. So that's it for the stream. Thank you very, very much for watching. I really do appreciate it. We enjoy doing these kind of things at Fire Gaming. It gives the clans uh, something to work for, something to be a part of, and also provides some entertainment and keeps me off the streets on a Saturday evening. So thank you very, very much for taking part. Thank you for watching. To the clans out there and the players who all took part, I hope you enjoyed it. The streams will, of course, go up on YouTube uh, in the next few hours, so you can rewatch your glory or your infamy if you want to. As always, enjoy gaming. Take care.